In this video we are fixing the no audio output device is installed message when you're whenever the speaker icon in the taskbar shows a red cross mark on it it means your audio adapter or card is not working anymore once you move the cursor over the icon you will get the message no audio output device is installed you may hear the beep sound for warnings which comes from the mini speaker built into the board for the beeping only to indicate issues this problem occurs due to a number of reasons However, 90% of the time this problem is triggered due to system upgrade and resulting hardware or software malfunction. When users upgrade their systems, the drivers stop working due to their lack of compatibility. Moving on to our methods, the first method that we are going to use is to use the audio troubleshooter. Right click on the speaker icon, click on troubleshoot sound problems. This wizard will look for the issues and it will display the results once the search is complete. Play any audio file and to check for the sound. If there is sound, your issue is resolved. If not, you can click on explore additional options and proceed accordingly. Next is to disable and re-enable your sound adapter. Hold Windows key and press R. Type hdwwiz.cpl. Expand sound, video and game controllers. Right click on your audio controller and click on disable driver. Click on yes. Once done, right click again and click on enable. Now test and see if the audio is back. If not, we are going to move to our next option. The third option that we have is to uninstall and update audio drivers. Using the same procedure, reach to this device manager, right click on the audio adapter and click on uninstall device. Click on uninstall. Restart your computer. On the restart, your windows will install this device again automatically. Check if your sound is back. Let's wait for the computer to get back online. Okay, so if you're unable to perform the steps mentioned so far uh, because of the missing sound video and game controller category in the device manager, proceed further with this video to find out what can be done if you're unable to find the category. Hold Windows and R key, type hdwwiz.cpl and hit enter. Click the action. If you only see help menu here, then click on this on the computer name and then click on the action menu. Now click on add legacy hardware. Proceed further, click on next for and install the hardware automatically click on next click next if the message wizard could not find any new hardware appears now here a list of hardware will now appear scroll down until you find sound video and game click next Now, choose your sound card manufacturer from the left panel and choose the panel from the right 
and then click on next to install the drivers. Once the visit completes, check for the sound and see if the issue is resolved. I hope this video will be helpful for you. Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe our channel.